Setting your own images for parts has always been one of the top feature requests for PartsBox. While most parts have default images from online databases, these aren't always great. And for local and meta parts, there was simply nothing to show. Well, from now on, you can add your own images, not only to parts, but also to projects and storage locations. Let me show you how that works. Let's begin in the list of parts and open one of the parts. This particular part is a subassembly, the result of building one of the projects. If I go into Images and Files, I can upload my own custom image to be used for this part. You can do this using the browser upload interface, but I prefer to simply use drag and drop to take an image file from my desktop and drop it onto the upload button. As you can see, the part image was updated. From now on, this is the thumbnail that will be used in all tables where this part appears. You can do the same thing for storage locations. Just take a picture of where you keep your parts and drop it in. One thing to note, if you modify your default table configurations, you might not see the thumbnails in your table because parts box will not change your custom configuration. To fix this, go into table configuration and either add the thumbnail column or reset the table to its default configuration which has the thumbnail as the first column in the table. You can also set images for your projects. These will show up in tables, as well as the project's cards view. Now, some of you have already uploaded your images as file attachments. Not a problem. If you have attached files with the type set to image, you can quickly select any one of them to be used as the part image. I hope you enjoy this new functionality. It is available to everyone, including the free Hobbies Maker Plan. Thanks for watching and have fun!